It's the 2K Sports pregame show. Greetings, NBA fans. Welcome to 2K Sports. I'm your host, Ernie Johnson, and seated beside me, Kenny the Jet Smith and the Diesel, Shaquille O'Neal. In this game, we'll see the Brooklyn Nets going up against the Warriors out in Oakland. Well, for Golden State, they're looking to come out strong and make their mark early. They have to look at this game as a great opportunity to do just that. And guys, the fans always enjoy hearing stories from your playing days. Uh, let's talk teammates. Shaq, who were your favorite guys to play with over the years? You know, everyone loves the Shaq, and Shaq has four rings, but I'm, I'm saying it here. They all in love real the life. Shaq. Everybody loves Shaq. Okay. I'm, I'm sexy, handsome, and qualified. That's what Shaq's talking oh, about. I think my question but anyway, was, who were your favorite teammates? Let me finish, Ernie. Let me finish. I'm quick to say, hey, I got four rings, but I could, could You not, are quick to say that. Could not do without <laughs> Brian Shaw. Brian Shaw was a guy that always looked for me, similar with, with, with how Kenny played with the team. He came down, made sure I got my shots off first. Derek Fisher, we all remember the .04 shot. Rick Fox was a hustler to go out and play. Big shot Bob. Oh, wow, saved one me of my so favorites, too. Times. So he's, he's won both of our favorites. Big shot Bob saved me so many times. I would probably only have one without Big shot Bob. And Nick Van Exel, even though me and Nick didn't, didn't win together, we had a great time. Well, obviously, he said big shot. Hakeem. Sam Cassell, Robert Ory, Vernon Maxwell. But one of my favorite of all time, Chucky Brown. Oh, yeah. My favorite teammate is Chucky Brown of you all time. You didn't say Otis Thorpe? No, but he, Otis was cool. Oh, my but God. But Chucky Brown was my favorite teammate of all time, man. Guess who I would say my favorite teammates are? Who? Who's that? It's us? Oh, Ernie. Really? I thought you were going to say Thanks, another Ernie. guy who wasn't here. I'm getting choked up a little bit. Thanks for joining us. Need some tissue. Let's meet the starting line of the visiting Brooklyn Nets. At shooting guard, Markel Brown. At the other guard position, Jared Jack. At power forward, Thaddeus Young. At the other forward position, Joe Johnson. At center, Brooke Lopez. The head coach of the visiting team is Lionel Hollins. Welcome to 2K Sports for another edition of NBA Basketball. This is Kevin Harlan along with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony with Doris Burke reporting on the sidelines. The fans are making noise here inside the Oracle Arena for their Warriors. Hey, 
will be the Nets off the tip. Here are the starters for Brooklyn. Brown at the two with Johnson at the three. Brooke Lopez is out there with Young. And it's Jack in at the point guard position. And the foul on Jared Jack. That is his first foul of the game. Yeah, clearly he had an established position there. Yeah, and, and I, I like this call because you want the refs in that situation. If there's any doubt, err on the side of giving the benefit of the doubt to the offensive player. That should have been a block, and it was. Now here's Curry. A shot by Thompson, and no one's around. From outside, off the mark. Clark, remember a year ago, Clay Thompson was the subject of trade speculation, possibly, in fact, going to the Timberwolves for Kevin Love. Yeah, in the end, the Warriors stood pat, and it was a controversial decision at that point, but I don't think there's any question it was a pretty good move for the <laughs> yes, Warriors right. right now. Warriors on D. Outside Jack. To the inside, stolen by Thompson. And here we go, Thompson heading to the hoop. And that one's good. Barnes has got his first bucket in this one. No doubt that is within his range. Well, I would hope so. He's a pro, and it was only a one-footer. Come on now. Lopez, a screen on Curry. And Jack, here we go. Johnson, wide open. He fires. Here's Lopez. And again, it's the Nets missing. The Warriors have gone two or three here to start out the game. Barnes dishes to Curry. Back to Barnes. Fires from deep. And that one's good. Barnes has got five now. And you can sense the momentum really starting to swing their way. Yeah, they're taking charge here. I mean, there's no question about it, Greg. And the lead, I think, is just going to continue to, to grow and grow from here. Now here is Jack. Six on the shot clock. Johnson against Thompson. And it's going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. Here's Curry. Let's now go to Doris Burke over across the way who spoke with Lionel Hollins, and uh, Doris, take it away. He talked about the impact of opposing big man Andrew Bogut, saying there just aren't that many seven-footers with his kind of game. A great interior defender first and foremost. We can't get tunnel vision when we attack the rim. He's got size and strength, and we can't allow him to bully us for offensive rebounds. Let's see if they can keep Bogut from having a big game, guys. And as always, Doris, thank you. For so long, there has been this mindset that Golden State wins through offense. But their defense, you know, Gia, you were talking about this, is where the true strength of this team lies. Yeah, I think that's what's really allowed them to separate when you look at the rest of the league. I mean, they led the league in opponent's field goal percentage last season. And some nights, the shots weren't falling, but the defense always showed up. Four on the shot clock. That shot wide open. And guys, I was a bit worried, but now we all know the rim doesn't have a lid on. <laughs> yeah, you could actually feel the tightness and tenseness with each miss. I'm actually glad to see they got that first one out of the way. And you know with the Warriors, it goes beyond the stats. High character guys, tremendous culture. They had a lot of guys that could guard multiple positions and defend them well. That was a big reason they became champs. Now here's Brown. Here's Young. The shot's good. Brown That's making the play. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. Curry kicks to Green. Jack against Curry. From downtown, the rebound by Young. And you just look at this Warriors roster, and there are a ton of defensive playmakers. That ability to switch everything and be fine is what made them so tough on the defensive side of the ball. And the shot is good. Warriors leading by three.
the floor. And then for Brooklyn, Bargnani has checked in for Lopez. Thomas Robinson comes in for Young. And Ellington is subbed in for Brown. One forty-one left to play in the first quarter. Here's Spates. That drops and it comes off the assist from Livingston. Spates has got his first basket. They are really doing a nice job establishing a presence inside early. Yeah, and watch, Clark, how the game plays out because this is going to open things up on the perimeter. Now here's Johnson. Elbow shot. And again, it's Brooklyn converting. Man, he's having quite the quarter converting at a really high percentage. And look, Joe Johnson last season, not his best statistically, but boy, did he show some heart. I mean, he was one of the catalysts for Brooklyn making the playoffs, especially when Brook Lopez returned healthy and, and the two could play off of one another. Here's Igudala, and he drops in the way up off the glass. Three consecutive baskets have come right at the rim. The defense had better start buckling down and tightening up. Guys, they are getting exposed in terms of their low post defense. Now, here is Jack. He hasn't scored yet. That, I'm sure, will change. And he thought he had a clear path to the hoop, but the defense didn't give up on that play and cut him off. Barbosa gets the bucket. Leandro Barbosa. Now, here is Jack. There's 25 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. In the corner, it's Ellington. Releases from the wing and drills it. There's 14 seconds left to play here in the first. Livingston kicks to Spates. Fires from 14. Shot is off. And that does it for the first quarter. Warriors lead by five. The second quarter coming up right after this break, so don't go anywhere.